Have you ever wondered, why do bananas turn brown? Well, today we are learning about this and so much more with my experiment, Brown Apples. Hi everyone, I'm Emily Calandrelli, MIT engineer and host of Emily's Wonder Lab. And on my channel, we learn about all things space and science. So grab your apples because this experiment is gonna be bananas. Did you know that bananas start out green? Just like plants, this is due to the presence of chlorophyll. As the banana ripens, the chlorophyll in the peel breaks down, revealing a yellow color underneath. This is similar to how leaves change color in the fall. In this experiment, we'll use our knowledge of the ripening process to save our apples from turning brown. You need one cup of water, two tablespoons of honey, a bowl to mix those two together in, one apple and two different plates. The first thing you wanna do is slice your apple into eight different apple slices, just like this. We are going to separate these onto our two plates, four slices here and four slices here. This one is going to be what's known as our control. We're not going to change anything about these apples. They're just going to sit out naturally. But for these, we are going to use a honey solution to preserve them. To make your honey solution, just mix one cup of water with two tablespoons of honey. Gently mix that together. Once your honey is properly mixed, what we're going to do is soak our apples in the honey solution for about 30 seconds. Once it's been 30 seconds, go ahead and take your apple slices out, shake off any excess honey water, and then place them right back on your plate. Now we have our honey water apples and our regular apples. And what you're going to do is simply wait and observe. Every hour that passes, I want you to come back to your apples and see which ones have browned more. I think you'll be excited to see what you find. It has now been four hours and look at our apples. Okay, can you tell which ones are the honey apples and which one is our control? This one is clearly much browner than this one. So this one was our control. We did nothing to this one. This one, these are our honey apples. The ones that look basically like I had just cut them. These are our honey apples. So why did this happen? Well, apples turn brown for the very same reason that bananas turn brown. That enzyme polyphenol oxidase creates melanin in the apples turning them brown. But here's the cool thing about honey. It contains a peptide that deactivates that polyphenol oxidase, slowing down the browning process and saving our apples over here from being too brown. And the cool part is that they don't really taste any different. They might taste a little bit sweeter, but they still just taste like apples. You haven't really changed your apples at all. You've just saved them from browning too quickly. This is a really helpful tip if you like to eat apples for lunch, but you need to prepare your lunch in the morning. You don't want your apples to be brown by the time that you eat them. So do this trick in the morning and then they'll be perfect by lunchtime. Thanks for making brown apples with me. If you like this one, be sure to check out my best-selling Stay Curious and Keep Exploring book series for 99 more science experiments. I'm Emily Calandrelli. Subscribe for all things science and space. And remember, stay curious and keep exploring. I'll see you next time. Emily's Science Lab.